You know, there is one way to fix this. What's that? Do as they ask. I, I couldn't. Why? It's the tradition. But the ABC will argue it's their tradition that fighters must shave. I'm a Sikh. This is our way. Not all Sikhs follow those ways. Well, look, this is about me, who I am. This is my right. Damn right it is. It was based on a true story, or inspired by a true story, um, about a man called Putty, um, who had to fight for his rights, um, fight for his rights uh, to, to be able to shave. I mean, it, it almost sounds a bit uh, ridiculous, doesn't it, when you think nowadays, but that he literally had to fight in court and through human rights commissions to have permission to not shave in order to fight. A lot of the time growing up, I didn't really fit into any roles because I'm half Chinese and I'm half American and they're not really quite sure where to place me. So I definitely did feel a little bit for Party's character when I read this, you know, that he just doesn't want to be seen as any specific thing. He wants to be seen as a human and as a person and he's talented in what he does and he's passionate about what he does and he doesn't want anybody to, you know, categorize him in any way. Well, Mickey Rourke is, is a legend, of course, and, you know, he's, he's been working for 20 or 30 years. He's been a movie star for 20 or 30 years. Um, the kind of performances that he does are always grounded, very real, earthy, passionate. Um, there's so much depth detail in, in what he brings to what he does. So in, in our film, Mickey's role is as a mentor and a coach to uh, Paddy. Come on, Tiger. Come on, let's go. Let's see what you got. You know what? I, I want people to be able to see, say that uh, if this is American, we're American, um, this is our story, and if they could find some inspiration, pride, um, to be able to stand up and, and defend. And, and I've always talked about the metaphor when it comes to human rights in sports that uh, don't be on the sidelines. It was inspiring to, to know that there's still people out there that really care about uh, what they believe in and, and, what they, and, and the rights that we have. Everyone is human, everybody has blood, everybody has feelings in their soul. And I feel like um, you just have to, you have to go with whatever you believe in. There's a lot of, you know, people in this world that are very narrow-minded and, and, and they can't really open up their eyes to see the big picture here. And I think that was the right time to actually show, show this to the world. He didn't want to change who he was. And that's, that's what, he stood up for his beliefs, he stood up for his rights, and he stood up for being an American. And he did not give up from it. And that's what, uh, I think that's what everybody loves to see. Everybody loves to see that on the dog. And he's not your typical underdog. Everybody wants to see him succeed. And he doesn't. And when he does, people are going to cheer him because he just wants to be seen for who he is. And I think the, the most important thing is that the rest of the world, not just Sikhs, but the rest of the world can resonate with this movie, is it doesn't matter who you are, it doesn't matter what sexual orientation you are, it doesn't matter what race or color you are, you can relate to this movie because everybody um, has been discriminated. They've been bullied, they've been picked on, and this is a great movie for those people to take a look at that. You do not have to change who you are. And that's what's most important to me, is not changing who you are. And that's why I love this movie.